Hey everybody, today we're gonna to do a really quick one on the caffeine levels of tea and coffee. So you can kind of get an idea, how much caffeine are you taking in per day? I can tell you right now, I'm taking in a lot. So let's start out with teas. Tea, well, we'll just actually go from lowest to highest because tea happens to be on the lower end. So let's start out with basic tea. Basic tea doesn't have any caffeine. So it's gonna have zero milligrams. Uh, after that green tea, green tea has 40 milligrams of caffeine. After that, black tea. Black tea is going to have 50 milligrams of caffeine. After that is matcha. Matcha has 60 milligrams of uh, caffeine. And right there, we're going to be kind of starting to flip over into coffees. Coffees, espresso. Espresso has 70 milligrams. Now that's a small, it's by serving. So it's a small serving. If you double that, you're going to have the same as normal coffee. Normal coffee has 140 milligrams of caffeine. After that, cold brew cold brew has 155 milligrams of caffeine now the one that really will kick start your morning if you need to just get going and you need a blast fast nitro is the way to go per serving it has 215 milligrams of caffeine now this may vary from brand to brand and mix of how they they put together their coffee or espresso or nitro or whatever but that's a general guideline of how much caffeine that you're going to be taking in so Hope you enjoyed and uh, take care and keep the jitters down. Take care. Bye.